you guys I'm going to do a video today and it's going to be a pretty interesting video because the video today is does your boss like you and it's going to be like sexually like does he want to give you his glizzy or does she want to give you her taco so we have two three pals here it's going to be a pick a card so pal one is tarot of dreams this is how the card look off of the Tower of Dreams. In case you want to connect with the card. Pile three. The Light Sears. No, Pile two. Sorry. I don't know why I said Pile three. Maybe universally. People are going to go to Pile three. I don't know. It's a card to connect with Pile two. Pile three is the Gilded Tarot. This is the card to it. I don't have copyrights to the music in the background. For this video, look inside the description box. Because that's the default part of where the timestamp will be. Or it will be inside the message. But it will be in the description box. So, pick your pal and I'll be back with you. Okay, pal one, you're up. Matter of fact, I don't need to do that. I already prepped the cards. What I'm doing? It's like I want to just pick a card like that, but I'm not doing it short. This is an actual pick a card. Okay, so the question is, does your boy, um, boss like you sexually? Does he want to give you his glizzy, or does she want to give you her tacos? By the way, thank you, you guys, for making me reach past 100 subscribers. And I am going to give you the details for the contest I'm going to hold for you guys. So, I'm just going to do this first and I'll give you the details because I don't want to be a bunch of confusion if you haven't liked or subscribed um, to my video and you have gotten something from it once it's done I'd appreciate if you can like and subscribe if you want to be a part of the contest you will have to be subscribed okay so here we go does power one boss like them sexually gatekeepers and if the answer is yes I have another pal where I'm gonna um <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give you some insight on what he wants or she wants to do. Okay. Does the power one um, boss like them sexually? All right, even. Does power one boss like them sexually? One more card, gatekeepers, please. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm laughing because you're going to see why I'm laughing once, you know. Okay, so I said, does Power One Boss like them? Does Power One Boss want to give them the glizzy or the taco? So look what popped out. The Six of Wands. The Six of Wands is a fire sign. A Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. A Six of Wands love to be praised. A Six of Wands love to be seen. A Six of Wands love all of the um excitement he's like a battle a, a man that came from battle or from war and he's victorious and everyone is like praising him so the answer is yes he does want to have sex with you power one and yeah like i said um this is a leo energy here you can have leo and jupiter or but this is this is leo energy right here okay what came out is the world came out now the world to me is somebody from uh, from the island someone not of American descent maybe he could be but to me it's like it's not the world also is all the elements within the, um, the world card you see the earth right here is air right here is cups and right here is fire water and fire so to me the world is someone and he has like the little joker is there like the little um what I like to say um court jester He's right there in the middle, like he wants to be seen. So, again, yes. Then you have the lovers. So they really want to have sex with you. Yes, they do. <laughs> the lovers is Gemini energy, normally. They want to have passionate love with you, too. You see the candles down there? It's romantic. It's all passionate. They probably feel for you a lot, and you don't know. It seems like they do. And then here you have the Five of Cups. Um, um, Cancer Pisces Scorpio card and it looks like they have like Scorpio and their um, Mars potentially or it could be a Scorpio and they burdened by this they really want you the Five of Cups is someone who's been left out 
who's burdened, who's been breadcrumbed, who feel lack, and it's all cups down there. So they really want to have sex with you. So this is the card, the deck that I'm going to clarify this with. I've already prepared the deck, and I'm going to cut the deck, and we're going to go from there. It's not going to be a long reading. I'm going to give you some details, though. Clarify the Six of Wands in regards to Power One Boss. What does Six of Wands, the Boss wants to do with Power One? Whoa, that's a lot. I'm not taking all those cards. I should have, but I wasn't really called to. What does Power One Boss wants to do with them sexually? Gatekeepers. All or none, you see? It was just a thick pile of nothing. Okay, so it came out. <laughs> it's the four wands. The four wands is stability. They they want to bring you um, foundation. They want to bring you stability. They want to bring um, um, firmness. I'm not going to bring it up close. But if you zoom into this card, you can see what they want to bring you. But the four wands is for um, groundedness, structure. That's what grounded um, four wands is. A happy home. That's what it is. What's this card? This is a brand new deck too, matter of fact. I've never even used this deck ever. Um, this is the Nine of Pentacles. So, the Nine of Pentacles is a female that's... Um, she can be opulent. She comes across opulent. She comes across bougie. She comes across sure of herself. She's very um, flirtatious and, and, and nice and loving. And um, she's grounded into her... Um, when I say she's grounded, she's a grounded person. But she's grounded into her money. She takes her money very seriously. She could be an entrepreneur. She's a business person. But look what they, they want to do. They want you to lay down. Again, I'm not going to bring these cards up close because of YouTube. And, but they want to you to lay down and let them go to town on your taco. What is this? This is the Six of Swords. So the Six of Swords is normally... And it's called, it looked like they want to take you away. You see all that revving? Do you hear all that revving in the background? All right. You can see this card because it's not too crazy. But they're in their mind, they're thinking. They, they like to pleasure themselves thinking about you. Look at this card. You see he want to take you by your hand? You see him? And drag you away and everybody else is in uproar. There are other people who like you. In regards to the lovers card. Clarify the lovers and what, and what the power ones um, boss want to do with them. Gatekeepers. Clarify the lovers. Thank you. You have the seven of cups. There's options. There's a lot of options. They want... Look at the card. I can show you this card. Just look at them. He's eating his share. She's leaning in. There are a lot of options here. It's up for grabs. Look at the female. You're probably a male. You could be a male. But energy is interchangeable. But look how she's looking at him. She's looking at him just as how he's eating this bowl of soup or whatever he's eating. Like, it tastes very good. Yeah. They want to devour you. They do. You see how... Her finger is in her mouth. It could be a male. It could be a female. You you choose how this works for you. But look. They really want to devour you. <laughs> this is so funny. It's funny. This is kind of disturbing too because it's your boss. I don't know. If you like your boss. If not. The five of, Why is the five of cups? Well, I'll take... I'll get two more cards. Two more cards for the lovers. What, what does the boss wants to do to power one? Two more cards for the lovers. Gatekeepers, what does, I have three cards, wow. Okay, they have the Ace of Swords, what I'm saying is true, okay? I'm going to hold this back here. If you want to take a still shot and zoom in, you could. What I'm saying is true. 
and it's a a, 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 um, a downloads because this what I'm doing is all off of downloads and intuition so what I'm saying is true and the tool this Asa let me show you something this Asa Swords I'm gonna cover her up because you know a little bit but look you have the two the lovers right there you have the lovers right there they're very serious about what they want to do to you they serious they've already thought it through they want to come in to make it a new beginning a new something yeah they serious then you have the knight of yeah it looks like you you must be somebody older i mean younger than this person you could be somebody younger than this person or you come across as younger than him spiritually because there's a young girl here look at her he has his sword up he's ready He's ready. He's decided this. He thought it through. There's not too much, um, um, like love here. It's all about logics and want to physically do it. The seven of the cups is options. There's not much love here in regards to the lovers, but they, they really want to give it to you. They do. They're ready. And this little girl looks like she's ready. Look at her stance. In this situation, it, the, um, the female could be propositioning you. Once again, it could be a male or a female boss. However you put it, they want to proposition you. And then you have right here is the um, Eight of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles is um, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Swords is Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, just so you know, because I didn't tell you. But this person wants to please you... Um, how can I say? What is digits? They want you to lie on them. Like, you know, spooning. But, you know, like, you want to play, please you with his digits again. Card is back here. You can see it. Okay. I'm about to end this. Why is they the boss burden? Why is the five of cups here in regards to power one? Yeah, it's a lot of confusion. It's confusion. Maybe it's a situation where you're not supposed to be dealing with your boss on your job. Because that was just a lot of confusion when I was shuffling. It was like sh -sh 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 going nowhere, though. It's like somebody back in their fist going nowhere. Why is the um, Five of Cups here? The Five of Cups here is because the Two of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. This is a, a water sign that's burdened. And the lovers, it could be many people who want a couple of bosses you have, managers or whoever. The lovers, they in their mind. It's not too much uh, thinking about this. They have, they, they see the options with you. They want to go through with it. Pal, with the five of cups, you have somebody who just, they have, look. They want to give you rabbit ears, if you know what that means. We all big people here. Um, I'm going to end this because I always give power one a lot of um, time. The world. One call for the world, gatekeepers, and then I'm going to end this. Yeah, they want to give you rabbit ears. They want to put your legs up. They want to rabbit ear you. Right here is the three of pentacles. They want to toss your salad. If you know what that means. <laughs> Look at the card. You can zoom in if you want. If you could, you could. But they want to toss your salad. I'm going to end it there. If you have gotten anything from this, um, um, please like and subscribe. I'm holding a contest, like I said, because you guys have made me reach more than 100 subscribers, and I appreciate it. At the bottom of the deck, you have, he wants, um, he wants, it's a male here, but he wants to have transform transformation in this. I don't know. It's not going well. It's like you playing with him. You're just laying there thinking about it, but he wants some he wants you to put your mouth on his glizzy again if you have gotten anything from this please like and subscribe take care till next time okay pal two you're up and the topic is does your boss like you sexually does he want to give you the glizzy does she want to give you the taco Timestamp is going to be in the description and you can look in the message box as well but just look in the description for default now, thank you, you guys, for making me reach more than 100 subscribers. I told you I'm going to hold a contest. I'm going to give you the descriptions of this contest. 
So if you haven't liked or subscribed, I would appreciate it if you have gotten anything from this video. And I also want to thank you guys who decided to subscribe to my channel. You have to be subscribed to my channel to enter the contest. So I just need to cut the deck. The deck was already prepped, but I was just working energy into the deck. Now, for POW 2, gatekeepers, does they boss like them sexually? Does POW 2 boss like them sexually? Do they want to give them the glizzy or the taco? Whoa, sheesh, too many cards. Too many cards, too many cards. Does your boss for POW 2 want to give you the glizzy or the taco? Gatekeepers. Can I have one or two cards? Not a whole pile. Oh. It must be competition for you, pal two. Pal two. Energy for pal two. Does their boss want to have sex with them? It's a secret. I could tell you that. Gatekeepers. Pal two. This is not going to be a long reading either. I just want to... Listen, this is ridiculous. You have the Three of Pentacles. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, your boss. A Queen of Swords, a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. And then you have the Star. They hope and praying and dreaming to get with you. Yeah, they want to get with you. They want teamwork. It's probably you and your co-worker they want. They have an eye on two of y'all. And y'all friends. One more card, gatekeepers. Does Okay, thank you kindly. Yeah. Your boss wants you and your friend. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Happy birthday to you, Sagittarius. Sorry for that. It's your season. If it's not your birthday today, when your birthday come, enjoy yourself. I have a lot of Saggy in my chart, so I know y'all gonna have fun. Y'all like to have fun. Being at your boss, do you wanna um have sex with you? I'm gonna um what do you call it? Clarify with this card. It's a sexual debt. So let's see what I'm gonna clarify first. Three of Pentacles. Tell me more about this Three of Pentacles energy in regards to the um boss wanting to have sex with him. These cards is going to depict what the boss really want to do. Shit, you see? Look, I'll take these three right here. Because that was just crazy. And that's depictive of what happened. You see what just happened, pal, too? With the first card that came out, y'all, he want to have sex with y'all, or y'all did have sex, and y'all were busted having sex. You see how all that confusion just happened, just fell out the deck like that? Yeah. And he must be having sex with maybe somebody else. Because like I said, I wanted to clarify the three of pentacles. And there's two energies here with different females. Look at this female here. You guys were caught having sex. I think this female must have caught y'all in the middle of the um, these two cards. Because these cards are really not um, depicting of anything. It's more using your intuition. Well, it is depicted of things, but you use your, I use my intuition because I'm an intuitive person. This is the high priestess. The high priestess is a Pisces card. So you already know if your boss want to have sex with you. And I'm sure you know that your friend or somebody around his job is having sex with your boss actively now. And you've caught them. And they had to do something quick to get away. Like, like, or this... It could be your boss. You could have been at your boss' house. You could have been somewhere where you shouldn't have been, at a hotel, where he had to immediately retreat. Him or it's a, It could be a male. It could be a female. Energy is, you know, both ways. And then you have the, um, the Ten of Wands. He's burdened by how much sex he want to have with you. Or maybe you like to have so much sex, you done had so much sex with him, that you tire him out. Maybe you exhaust him sexually. Or vice versa. But this person is being carried away. But look at all the wands. The wands are indicative of you already know. You could pause this and zoom in to see what it what it is. What I'm talking about. Why is the star here? Because of YouTube regulations. 
Why is the star here? In regards if the boss want to be with them or not. Tell me, tell me why is the star here? What is he hoping and dreaming about? Because the stars are Aquarius energy. It's a visionary. What they hoping and dreaming about? What is this boss hoping and dreaming about? Some head. You just being digmatized or so crazy in your head about their vagina. That's what they want. They want you to be um, crazy about them. They want to turn you out, basically. Look, it could be you could be a young, younger than your boss, and you propositioning your boss. Cause look at you with your slits on the side of your dress. Look at your stance, and he's there with his wand. All thoughts, thinking about it, like should I go through this? Should I go through with this or not? And it's indicative of the star. He thinking, should I go through with this? But you could be a young female. Young looking, young in spirit, you could be very pretty too, because this is a pretty female. Why is what else is the star and the star energy here for? I'm gonna end this because it's not gonna be long. Because I'm gonna get to power three too. I gotta get to power three. Yeah, they want to take you away. They want to take you away. It's an ace of cups, and what I'm saying is true. They want to take you away, but this is kind of a dangerous situation, a poisonous situation, a situation that should not be entertained. But yeah, he wants you to be barebacked, bareback on, or in his car, his vehicle, wherever. He wants you, yeah, ready, because he's taking this person up to a castle. I can't really show you the card up close. You can zoom in. Why is the Queen of Swords here in regards to if the boss wants to have sexual intercourse with the worker? This is somebody watching this too because there's multiple people here. This Queen of Swords is watching it. Yeah, Three of Cups. There's multiple people. Your boss um, like multiple people. There's a co-worker potentially watching this. But the Three of Cups is having a lot of fun. Three sums and all that. He want to push his fingers up in you. Just like from behind. Just pull up your clothes and just, you know, push his fingers in you. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? In regards to, yeah, the Three of Pentacles. He, he want to have, he want to toss your salad. He's deciding, thinking about tossing your salad and having a third party with you. If you can see this card back here. He's in thought about this. He want to do this bad. And that's a um could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a uh, um Taurus. Yeah, the magician. He wanna manifest this. He wanna manifest giving you some bacchus. Give you doggy style. If you have gotten anything from this video, I appreciate you. If you subscribe and like and he want look at this. He wants you to be be, you know, yeah, that. Take care. Till next time. Pile three, we're up. I already prepped the deck. All I knew need to do is cut it. So thank you, you guys, who have made me reach over 100. I'm going to put the details for the contest that I'm going to do for you guys um, in the description box. Or I may do a little segment at the end and tell you what you need to do. But you'll, you'll, you'll find out. You have to be subscribed to enter the contest. Again, thank you, you guys, who have liked and subscribed to my videos and liked my content. I really appreciate you guys. So, today, the video is going to be about, does your boss like you sexually? Does he want to give you the glizzy, or does she want to give you the taco? And if the answer is yes, I'm going to clarify it with another deck, a sexual deck. So, I'm not wasn't asking for a card, but I'll use that as the overall energy. Okay. Gatekeepers, does they boss you the high priestess? You know if your boss want to have sex with you or not. This is a Pisces card. You already know what it is, pile three. If you have been called to go to any other pals, go there because you'll get messages. The seven of swords is here. Yeah, he want to have sex with you. He want to do some griminess and have sex with you. But is his intentions good? Uh, no, his intentions are not good. But yes, he does want to... Let me get other cards out. But you're Pisces. You're supposed to know. Pisces know everything and says nothing. 
Pisces are also looked at as a um, a, a scientist in their own right because they know how to do with, deal with energy. So again, you know, does power one, power three? See power one. I said power one. Maybe you should go to power one. Um, does power three force want to have sex with them? Do they want to give up the glizzy or the taco? They think about this. They reminisce about this. I don't know if they're going to put with reminiscing about betraying you or what, but they, yeah, they see the innocence in you. Again, you, this pal is different from the other pals, but they're kind of connecting, but it's weird, the energy. Does the boss want to um, be with pal three? Gatekeepers? Does the boss want to... Ten of Wands. Yeah, he... This is burdening him. These, this... Well, maybe y'all been together already, and he's... I don't know, this pile three is different. It seemed like I'm gonna have to kind of dig in this differently. I don't... Well, uh, at the bottom is the Eight of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. Maybe y'all had sex already, and this thing went south, or they want to have sex with you, and they see you not entertaining them, you walking away with them. But I think y'all did have something here. And this boss is burdened. Yeah, Three of Swords. Y'all have had sex already, I believe. Or if y'all haven't, it pains them to think about this. This, It pains them to think about this. Because you walk away, you're more intuitive. You know not to have sex with them. Because they're they a treacherous, grimy person, a snake in the grass. Someone who does things that they shouldn't do. they they treacherous. They, they try to sneak in and, and get away with things. They try to manipulate things. The energy behind the scenes, like turn people against you, what type of stuff like that. And there's burdens here. But this is kind of, I can't, this pile is different. It's totally different. I don't know if I'm going to clarify it with the other deck or not, the way this is going. Let me see something. This deck is prepped already. I just need to cut it. This, this pal is weird. It's really... Why, why is the Three of Swords here in regards to if the um, boss wants to have sex with pal three? This is a brand new deck, too. This is my first time using this deck in any reading. Three of Swords, gatekeepers. Why is this Three of Swords here in regards to if the um, boss wants to have sex with their... This is the nine of wands in reverse. Yeah, yeah, I've had sex already. This is a card where he's giving her back shots and she's pleasing herself. But this is in, in the past. This relationship has caused destruction. I could tell you that. On this job. Maybe somebody lost their job. Yeah, the nine of wands, and then you have the ten of wands. So the nine of wands go from somebody who is blocked and guarded to somebody's burden behind this. Why is the seven of swords here in regards to do they boss want to have sex with them? Gatekeepers, why is the seven? Why is the seven of wands here in regards to if they boss want to have sex with them? Maybe this is not the deck I should be using. It feel like this is not the deck I should be using. I don't know. Hold on for a second. I'm going to use a Kipper deck for you guys. I'm going to try to see if I could get anything out of this Kipper deck. Because this, this, I don't know what the heck is going on here. There is burdens. You guys had sex already. And, yeah, I, I don't know. Why is the 8 of um, cups here in regards to the walking away? In regards to the pal 3 boss wanting to have sex with them? Why is the Eight of Cups here? You guys, again, know what's going on here. You the High Priestess. 
Nothing wants to come out for this that this pile. This is the energy kind of just went dead. What's going on with the seven of, seven of swords? Can I get a card for the seven of swords? This person is in thought behind this um being de deceptive by deceiving you by doing whatever grimy stuff they did to you. They ain't thought about it. This is why is the eight of cups here? Can I get a card for the eight of cups? The eight of cups. Can I get a card for the eight of cups? Yeah, walking away. Somebody being judged by this. Maybe you guys end up in ju in a court behind this. This was exposed in court, or maybe it was in. in you see, I'm tongue twisted. Exposed. This 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 information doesn't really want to come out. Somebody was. Somebody has been found out. I don't know if you guys had to go before a judge. If they took your money and you had to sue them, you went before a judge. I don't know if you guys had to go to a higher up as far as uh, the, the main boss and have a, a meeting about this. I don't know if you had to have delegates get involved as far as like um, if you have a. Um, what is the word? I can't think of the word. I don't know why my brain is going blank. If the word come to me, I'll say it. Ten of Wands. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Ten of Wands. Why is the Ten of Wands in this situation? A privileged lady. You're sneaking. Somebody, the boss have snuck away from a privileged lady. This was a privileged lady that this has happened to. Six of Cups. Why is the Six of Cups here? And then I'm going to end this reading. If you have gotten something from this, I appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Drop me a message if you want. Anything about the Six of Cups? Distance horizons. Somebody is in a distance horizon thinking about this. Maybe y'all have y'all are no longer together. Y'all are no longer together. A message of concern is coming from the distance and it's about a house. Something is going on here. Somebody's wife maybe found out about this on a job. I don't know. If you have gotten something from this. Please like and subscribe. Till next time, take care.